You are watching at Kids Storybook Cottage. Triceratops. With three horns on its face and a large bony frill. The Triceratops used its beak like mouth to chop down plants. It walked on four strong legs and was similar in size to a modern day elephant. Stegosaurus. Recognizable by the two rows of large plates along its back and a spiked tail. The Stegosaurus had a small head with simple teeth for eating soft plants and leaves. Brachiosaurus. This giant dinosaur had a long neck to reach high into the trees. It stood on four thick legs and was taller than most dinosaurs, with nostrils on the top of its head. Apatosaurus, formerly known as Brontosaurus, another large dinosaur with a long neck. The Apatosaurus could eat from the tops of trees. It had a long whip-like tail and bulky body. Iguanodon. This dinosaur could walk on two or four legs and had thumb spikes that it could have used for defense. It had a beak for pulling leaves and flat teeth for grinding them up. Ankylosaurus. With armored plates covering its back and a heavy club on its tail for defense, the Ankylosaurus was like a walking tank. It ate low-growing plants and had a wide, leaf-shaped tooth for grinding. Parasaurolophus. Known for its long, backward-leaning tube-like crest, which might have been used for communication, the Parasaurolophus was a duck-billed dinosaur that ate a variety of plants. Diplodocus. This long and slender dinosaur had a neck that stretched out far and a long tail. It likely swept its head from side to side to graze on ferns and other low-lying plants. Edmontosaurus, another duck-billed dinosaur with no teeth in its beak but many cheek teeth to grind up tough plant material. It had a crestless head and likely lived in herds.